What up YouTube, it's your boy Stutter Banana here, and uh, today I have another tutorial for you. Today I will be showing you how to use CC Light Burst, which is a, a like cool burst of light, hence the title of the effect. Um, I got hit up by this kid on YouTube, and he really wanted to learn how to do this, so I'm going to be bringing you guys how. Um, first things first, get a video. If it's already edited out of Sony Vegas, if you like to dub or render, you know, that's it's your thing, do what you want. Um, but I'll go ahead and drag it into the timeline. Now, there's two ways you could bring the effect to the video. You can either add the effect to the original clip directly to the uh, video file, or you can add an adjustment layer and add the effect to that. I'd rather have people do that, and I do it myself. Um, it's better, it's more customizable. Instead of adding the light burst to the video file, I don't know, it's just a habit. It just, I think it makes it, you know, way more easier in a way. Um, so I'm going to be going, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do this with the adjustment layer. All right. So now all you have to do is to add an adjustment layer. You go to layer, new, click adjustment layer. That easy. Um, okay, next you want to add the light burst. But before you do that, uh, let's find a point where we should add the light burst to come in. Let's see. Uh, about right there. All right. So he's scoping in right now. So we're gonna add the light burst effect to uh, the adjustment layer right now. Since I found my spot to add the adjustment, uh, not the adjustment layer. Pardon me. To add the effect, you right click on uh, the either the video. Make sure that the adjustment layer is selected first before you do that, or else you're going to add it to the video unless you want it to. Go ahead and right click, click Effect, click Generate, and then CC Light Burst. Go ahead and give that a click. Now it's already doing its thing, but you don't want it to come in at that spot. So you're going to put both intensity and ray length at zero. Now you're going to want to go to the drop down effect layer on the adjustment layer. Click effects. Click the CC light burst arrow. And now we're at a more customizable uh, menu. So now um, you don't want to add the light burst at this spot. You want to add it, okay, when the, when the guy's done scoping in and he's already shot the guy. So right now when both intensity and ray length are at zero, go ahead and click the stopwatches. Okay, this will basically make it to where when he's scoping in, there will be no light burst. But if I go one more frame over, and now you want the light burst to come in. So now you would set intensity to 100 and ray length to 50. Now that's when they come in. See if you notice, no light burst, then the light burst comes. Okay, the length is up to you. I usually do a standard like maybe. Mm, two seconds so about right here should be good um, once you've done that go ahead and set the intensity back to zero and the ray length back to zero and uh, let's see what we got here Let's see, let me go back to where you guys can't see the CC. All right, so this is what it looks like. See, that looks very nice. See, it goes from him scoping in. The second it comes out, light burst, bam. That looks super sweet. And um, that's about it, guys. Very simple tutorial, and uh, I hope this video helped you. Um, oh, and have a very good Merry Christmas, and uh, thanks a lot, guys.